This is your typical lightning bolt. It stretches a couple of miles into the sky and in real time lasts less than like half a second. On the 29th of April 2020, the GOES-16 and GOES-17 satellites detected something unbelievable. They spotted a single lightning bolt which snaked a world record breaking 770 kilometers in length. Okay, so the first scenario where charge was built up over a large laminar area and it discharged all at once in one continuous sheet, well that can be duplicated using a Van de Graaff generator. The metal dome resembles a source for local charging and an acrylic sheet acts as a laminar area to accumulate that charge. Placing the acrylic on top of the Van de Graaff and cranking up the power, the local charge reaches such a high threshold that it eventually flashes over, forming large fractal discharges. And scenario DOS, where the mega flash was composed of separate charge events and the previous discharge triggered the next, well that can be explained using a Marx generator. So I'm going to use freshwater resistors built of tap water inside of a silicon tube and saltwater capacitors built of plastic jars and saline water. When everything's charged, nothing happens. But if the conditions are right and the charge reaches a critical threshold, the gap between the first two charged areas breaks down and ionizes. This causes a cascading event where each next gap between charged areas breaks down. Instantaneously, all of the charge sections are connected in series, adding up their voltages and creating a tremendous discharge. 